Okay, quick addendum. Quick addendum. Try and keep this short. A couple of things I left out. Uh, hey there, Crime Stubbers. So, first things first. Uh, do we have all kinds of rules and, you know, it's you got to get a license, you got to take a test, and so forth when it comes to a car? Yeah, absolutely we do. Does that stop a drunk driver? Does that stop a guy in SSRIs from driving it through a crowd? So if you want to stop uh, the car from being used as a weapon, uh, we figured out that we need to go after the drunk driver, or we have to figure out how to keep it from uh, falling into the control uh, of a crazy person. That second one's a little harder. Um, then, on the other hand, we have guns. And let's see, the this Israel guy, the uh, sheriff from Broward County, is he with her? Why, yes. Yes, he is with her. Uh, Debbie Wasserman Schultz District. Um, it's so clear that the SSRIs are very much responsible for what's going on. Uh, we're, stop drugging our little boys. God damn it, stop drugging our little boys. Just stop it. It's not helping. Got a problem, take a pill. The, the pill is causing problems. 4% uh, of them. 4% of them. Suicidal thoughts. Act out suicidal thoughts. Act upon. Attempt to commit suicide. Or are successful. About 4% of them. And of that 4%, some of them uh, do uh, crazy things like this school shooting. But I mean, take a look at all the players involved. FBI getting its ass handed to them by Congress. Uh, two of the kids' parents were FBI. Uh, Debbie Washington Schultz District. Uh, cops from Clearwater come can't believe that the four cops uh, from uh, Broward County are still outside the building. Right? They got there as quick as they could. And they entered immediately. I don't know what the fucking cowards or coward Broward County guys were doing, but I don't think they were cowards. I think they were standing down. I think they were letting it happen. Professional shooter. Killing children. And then they blame this Patsy, just like they did when they shot JFK. And again, Parkland. Right? These guys, they're just doing this to you. Just all day long. This. The solutions they're offering up are ridiculous. Right? we got to get to the heart of the problem. The heart of the problem is these kids being drugged and the drugs having the side effect, suicidal thoughts, rage, violence, anxiety, depression. And these kids needed help. We need to take a look at this. And again, who else but satanic pedophiles would set it up. So if that kid had pot in his house, they could kick down his door and take him to prison. Uh, but he was uh, threatening people. They have records of him putting his uh, putting guns to a kid's head, or putting a gun to some kid's head. Uh, they have uh, right. How did this guy pass a background check? An FBI background check to get a gun. Looks a little set up to me, kids. I mean, okay, maybe the system failed and so forth, but it looks like no. Nah, looks uh, there was just too much on this kid. Take a closer look. Debbie Washerman Schultz, District. Who is the sheriff? Israel. Who is he connected to? Who are the other FBI agents connected to? Right? I mean, it's this one's painfully clear. Every kid's in the drama club. Their lines are scripted and ready that day. Unbelievable. And again... Some crazy 18-year-old kid in Florida is going to dictate policy for the rest of the country. Educate self. Educate others. That's my little addendum, those things I left out. One is, yes, we regulate cars, but it still doesn't stop drunk drivers. And two, uh, this sheriff and the four sheriffs that didn't go in it's starting to look a little fishy. Do I have to hit you in the face with a fish for you to start looking? Doing some research? And then, oh, one other thing. We always want to talk about Australia. Let's talk about what happened in Israel when they had a school shooting. And since they have implemented those uh, policies, and take a look at the policies that Israel let you, let you do that on your own, kind of like that Q thing, right? Don't just give it to them. Just 
go take a look. Uh, since they've done that, they've had two uh, school shootings. Uh, both times the terrorists were killed with teachers, or by teachers who were packing. But uh, they wised up real quick. Can't get rid of the guns? Guard the damn kids. Right? We guard our, our politicians, our movie stars, our money, but not our kids. And then let's start talking about uh, other solutions. But first things first. Uh, the kids need to be guarded. That's very clear. And then we can start talking about other solutions. But step one, uh, let's make it so that we don't worry about the kids getting shot up because there aren't cowards, uh, four of them, outside the school. Because had some of those teachers that were throwing themselves in front of bullets been armed, uh, the the outcome may, might have been different. And once again, absolute proof positive. You're going to count on the state to protect your kids? Okay, Crime Stoppers. Educate self. Educate others. E pluribus unum. Talk to you soon.